All right, so the first step that we have done, we've set our main beam that runs on the bottom of the training rack up on two mortar pan stands. This will really help in ease and comfort of assembly. So Jody Little and myself pick the beam up, set it on top of these two mortar pans, and then we're ready to actually assemble each side. So as you look over here, I have laid out all the different components and parts that we need. So I have my base, my upright, my two rolling casters, and then my pins and my T-screw ready to assemble. All right, we've got our beam sitting here on our mortar pan stand, and this beam has two brackets which will insert on the base. So Jody and I are gonna start putting it together. Jody, let's put the casters on first. So Jody's gonna lift the base. I will insert one caster. Now the good thing about these casters, they are adjustable. So if you're at a level in the area that you're gonna set up on, you can make up for it easily with the caster. So it works out really good with the adjustable. So Jody and I are now gonna spin this around. And we're gonna insert that. Nice and easy just like that. And I have two pins. These two pins. And they will hold that in place until we insert the upright. All right, the last step in setting this up is our upright. So we have our upright here and then our T-screw. And our T-screw will secure the upright in and have the beam and the base frame and it all locks everything in nice and secure. So Jody, let's set the upright. So Jody's just gonna pick the upright up and it sets in right in the slot just like that. And then I have this T-screw, and I insert the T-screw. And we're ready to go on the right-hand side. Now we've got the training rack fully assembled. Now we're gonna show you, it has handles on each side on the upright. We're gonna actually show you that in a shop environment and while you're training, when you need to move it or if you need to move it, it's fully mobile. So Jody and I, if we can make a complete circle, with the training rack, you can lock the casters in place. Then the training rack is secure. Another option is, if we have an at a level grade, on this grade here, we're relatively close. We can put a level up and check that. And if I need to adjust any, which is showing I do, Now I'm perfectly level. That's the beauty of the adjustable casters on each side.
So we've hung our line in between the two uprights. And now I'm gonna mark this off on a six. So I get my modular rule. I get the line hanging dead on a six. And then I can come back here on the side and actually mark the upright off on a six. Very convenient, very easy. So then I go to the other side and do the same thing. Now our line's in position, marked on the six, we're ready to lay brick or block. Today, brick. Today, we've got the training rack set up. We're ready to go, and I've got the pleasure of having Miss Ashton White here. Ashton is a post-secondary, two-time Skills USA state and national champion. Ashton, what do you think of the new training rack? I like it. It's smooth, easy to use, pretty easy to access, and really comfortable. Awesome. You're doing a great job. Thank you. So she's laying brick to the line, and uh, this is what would be happening at a training school or a, uh, an employee training center is exactly what Ashton's demonstrating here. The ease of using the rack is unbelievable. And we've got two scaffold boards with our mortar pan stand and our brick on that. So comfortability is, is perfect for this training rack and workability is also perfect. So Ashton, thank you for coming today. Training rack is a phenomenal tool. We plan to use it with all of our career days, our school training, our instructors in their shop, apprentice training. We have a ton of opportunity for this training rack. As you can see, as, as Ashton's shown you, it works really good. As an instructor, I'm able to direct and talk and see everything that I need with a student. Uh, for the student, the ease, as far as the, where the starting point for laying is at, where you can put your material, it's just a comfortable tool to use in, tra in a training environment. The North Carolina Masonry Contractors Association is pleased to have this in our training trailer.